Hello everyone, it's Mel, and welcome back to more Siege of Dragonspear. So, something was pointed out to me in the comments for the episode, two episodes back actually, because I tend to be, yeah, whatever. Um, and it's the fact that I get held a lot. Like, a lot. So, something I did before I came up, before I just started up again, is I checked my scroll case. Just to see if I had any freedom of movement spells. What I found, though, is a pile of buffing spells. So, what I think I'm going to do here... Is just... We're going to quick save. We're going to rest. We're going to kill all the Skellingtons. Oh, good. Whirlwind's out of arrows. Okay. Does anyone have spare arrows? Okay, you have the arrow plus two. Safana, you have one arrow. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna do. Everyone dead? Everyone dead. Try again. is true. Um, actually, let's see. Do I- are there any arrows just kind of floating around? Yes? You know what? You want me? I'm a woman, not a pack mule. I dropped it. That'll do. Uh, you can hold that so I can grab some arrows. Just so I have something for her to keep what her do distance you need? with. You want it? You've got it. Ding ding, round three. And I may just skip until I actually get the rest off at this point. Oh. Well, that worked. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We are going to toss up protection from undead. Uh, protection from... Okay, you can't use that. Corwin can. Uh, protection from fear you can use. So, what we're going to do is we are going to buff up your orders? Oh. Wait, are you a fighter? You're an archer. Okay, I guess you can't cast that. Can you cast it? Yeah. Good. That's what I like to see. Would that there were more like you. Okay, we're gonna do a protection from fear. The words are welcome, friend. Mm -hmm. Um, we're gonna knock a bless off. Yes. We're going to haste everyone. Bacio, bacio, bacio. 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 
Then we are going to quick save. Tell me. When all else fails, it. we go with the power Thy demand. of many, many buffs. Uh, you work on that what? one. Also, I was doing some looking, and shaman kind of seem, at least spellcasting wise, seems to work like I would recognize five e clerics. Basically, the thing the thing with shamans is they don't have to prepare their spells; they have access to their entire spell list. The catch being, of course. That we still only have so many spell Sweetheart. slots a day. Okay, yeah, you're going to go shooting. Hmm? You're going to shoot. I. You're going to stab. Give it to me straight. You are going to stab. <laughs> What do you need? Yes. What? Okay. Actually, you Go two ahead. work on the bone bat. Ow! Tell me. We're going to... Uh, work on the greater gas, actually. Hmm? Uh, you can work on that one. Ha! I aim at true! Okay... Give it to me straight. This is a cluster of me trying to understand what's going on. White, Shadowed Soul. We're gonna get the ghasts again. Because the ghasts are what hold me. And? Please back up. Uh, you actually need to cast a healing spell. On Minx, please. I hear. Um. Four hmm. magic missiles, please. It really is, I basically just have to overcome the numbers. Safana, please back up. Hurry. Um, you need to heal Minx again, please. Okay, you know what, Rel? You are going after that shadowed soul because that needs to go down. Ha! My aim is true. Oh God. 
Uh, let's see if I can get another heal off before he dies. I need heal to fight. <laughs> Okay. Work on the mummy, please. Thy card. Work on the mummy, please. Why are you losing health? Energy drain? Uh crap. I um, give it to me straight. You pass your potions over to him. Yes. Get another heal on him, please. What? Okay. Now I just need Mix to not die. Oh. What do you need? Wait a minute, I don't see any icon for being poisoned. Unless diseased counts as a poison. Push me around. You might get pushed back. Um, neutralize. Oh, I don't have any neutralized poison. Crap. Um. Spell's ah. gone. Yes? Uh, potion of extra healing. Not to self. Doubler, here. Look what look up what disease ah. does. Ah. Need healing. Okay. Okay. Your orders. So now I'm going to just grab all of Minx's stuff. I can't carry that too. Yes. I dropped it. I am not a servant to carry I'm doing so much. Everything you ask. I have dropped it. <laughs> Okay. Tell We're me. We're going to quick save. Oh wait, I don't have to. Right. I can't carry that too. Uh, I dropped okay, it. Okay, Corwin. You carry that. You get this. Okay. Now let's get all his crap back on him. Um, necklace.
And now that we've done that... Okay. Yes. Much better. Though it looks like Safan is still suffering from energy drain. Which is another case of I have to look up that status yes, effect. Dear. Okay, that's where the lich is. We're gonna wait a hot second to see if that's trapped. And there's our third scepter. So, all go all right. Also, when did I ever say that all goblins look alike to me, McKin? Hey there. Oh right, I didn't. Whatever you like. Reach, dispel magic. Uh, who has some room to carry that? You do. Yeah? All right. Also, Minx has a mostly empty inventory. I have to remember this. You want me? Whatever you like. Good to know that's trapped. A quarter staff. Nice. Uh, Minx, get in here. Yes. Okay, nothing else in that room, which means... Don't worry about me. Sweetheart? Whatever you like. Mm -hmm. That likely connect the door to an opening mechanism northwest. So. Because we're in an isometric view. This way is north. Yeah, this way is north. Th and that way is west. What do you I mean? have a very dumb idea. Me. So to open the door to the li to Lichland, I went fall, autumn, summer, spring. No, winter, fall, summer, spring. So what if, Tell me. just what if, you want it, you've got it. I can't. Fair enough. So. We're going west is this way, north is this way. What can I interact with? Because this could be northwest. It could be. But it wasn't. It was basically just a monster hole. This is southwest of that location. straight I have a feeling it might be I might have to do something with the um, throne
What do you need? You want it, you've got it. Ah, concealed in the chair's left arm is an intricately carved wooden lever. I love dungeons. The mechanism it they connects to is old gold. but well made. It likely still functions. You pull the lever in the chair's arm and hear the sound of ancient gears grinding together. Traces of dust fall from the ceiling as the groan of moving metal echoes throughout the complex. Tell me. Yeah, that did that opened my door. Fantastic. I know there's a couple skeleton archers in here, which should at least get me some more bones. Bones, arrows. This is the end for you. Oh. Uh. This group shows promise. Extraordinary. Corwin? What did you do? What are your orders, hero? How did you cast a fireball? We're going to... I th I seem to remember saying I would bring back the remains. Give it to me straight. Don't worry about me. The cavity around the building's entrance has been dug into the dirt and rock piled over it, but there is little hope of escaping the site from here. Okay. So, there is the, uh, room of methods. I'm not sure I want to explore that yet. I think what I'm going to do I'm going to save and I'm going to Uh, you place a silver scepter into a slot at the side of the pedestal. Two empty slots remain. The third scepter slides smoothly into place in the side of the pedestal. Only one slot remains unfilled. And we slide the final scepter into the last empty slot on the pedestal. Though the air remains still and stagnant in the chamber, the pool atop the pedestal ripper ripples and begins to swirl. You find yourself thinking of people who have affected you most of late, of one especially. Hmm. Who's affected me the most of late? Because here's the thing, while I am on a quest to take care of Kalar, I actually think it's Imowen, just by the fact that she cared. As you think of her, the pool grows calm. An indistinct image appears within it, quickly growing in clarity. You find yourself watching a scene unfold from above, as a god might do. Concentrate, girl. Clear your mind of all thoughts. That should be easy. A lot of people say there isn't much thinking going on in there to begin with. You are not without wit, Imowen, but that will only take you so far. What you need and currently lack is focus. 
Forgive me, Duke Janath. It's just... It's hard. My best friend is charging into a dragon's mouth, and I'm just sitting here, thinking about magic and stuff. If you were truly thinking about magic, you'd not be talking so much. <laughs> Ow! I made a mistake. I should never have let them go face Kalar without me. In your current state, you'd be nothing but a burden. If you truly want to help your friend, you must focus your mind and your energies on your studies. You're right. I know you're right. All right. What am I supposed to do again? Clear your mind. Clear my mind. Right. I could do that. Clearing my mind. Clearing my mind. Mind being cleared. Clear mind. Cleared mind. Clear mind. Ah. Imowen, you're kind of adorable. As you pour the vial's clear fluid into the pool, the murky waters clear somewhat. A team like this can't be beat. Oh! Uh, let's think about Kalar. You know my name, you know my cause, but you do not know my story. Mine is a noble family, blessed in every way. The Argents are destined for greatness, or so some think. I thought it myself once. Thinking I could do no wrong, I wronged many, far too many. In time, I came to realize that my actions were not without consequence, that a price was paid, though it was not paid by me. I knew that had to change, but how? How might I redeem myself for my sins? For years I prayed for guidance, and then one day, one glorious day, an answer was bestowed on me by the gods themselves. Many have been taken from this world before their time, lost in the Dragon Spear Wars, dragged down into the Nine Hells in defiance of the Holy Order of Things. Some believe they are gone, never to return, I know better. With you at my back, I swear to you, what was lost will be restored! I give her points for having some charisma. Like, that was a good little speech. She has some charisma. You came. Good. I wasn't sure you would. I was curious. I had to learn who would be so arrogant, so foolish, as to summon me in such a fashion. Who are you who thinks himself my equal? My better, even, judging by your messages' tone. Me? I am not but a servant. Uh-huh. You sound smug. If you know who I am, you know that I do not deal with the servants of others. If your master would speak with me, I am happy to do so. Or has he grown so weak, even his words can no longer reach this plane? Wait. Wasn't that guy with... Do not doubt my master's power or our allies. You think I doubt the Umbral Accord's power? What's the Umbral, Ac Umbral Accord? If you respected it, you would not do as you did in Baldur's Gate. The child of Baal belongs to my master. Um, the child of Baal belongs to herself. I've done nothing to keep the godling from you. You are trying to influence Baal's spawn, and in doing so, you interfere with my master's business. The Accord will not let this continue. Perhaps you are right. Perhaps not. You do not speak for the Accord. 
and I do not bow to the demands of some broken fiend's lick spittle. Ouch! Harsh. Justified, but harsh. It's good to see in the dark. Okay, that takes care of the things in my inventory. Alright, let's get some killing done. Oh! Try again. Okay. What do you need? You want it, you've got it. So we have a door full of methods down here. You know what I think I can do? Let's check the scroll case again. Also, let's put a couple things in there. Uh, I should have protection from fire somewhere. Wait, um... She has it, I think, as one of her castables. Uh, resist fire and cold. My toes itch, boo. How much longer must I wait before we find a nice evil face worthy of kicking, do you think? By demand? There's no shortfall of faces deserving a good kick in this world. I'm sure we'll come across one sooner than later. Okay. Tell me. This is gonna go you poorly. It, you've got it. Magic radiates from the circle inscribed on the stone floor. It sparks and crackles. Images of a landscape seemingly sculpted by flame appear within it at irregular intervals, accompanied by a wave of stifling heat that rolls over your body. So, I don't know how to turn that off. But there's the lich down there. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go back to the dwarves. Because I do need to tell I them what this. is up. You've returned. What did you find? Any sign of Gernon Coldheart? More than a sign. I saw him as he was transformed into a lich. Coldheart a lich? Ah, ye lie, ye lion liar ye. May the gods strike me down if I am. Coldheart is no friend of yours. He came here to be transformed into a lich and he succeeded. The human knows truth. Samal knows. Coldhearth do dark things when he think he alone. He thinks Samal not know, but Samal know evil. Coldhearth evil. He... He hurt Samal. 
Tell Samal not to tell Auckland or other brothers. Oh, Samal, ye poor wee bloody great beastie, I don't want to believe ye, but you don't have it in you to lie, do you? At least not convincingly. All right then, you, Rao. You've got to help me. Though he betrayed me and mine, I cannot. F I can they fight Cold Hearth. He's, he was me oldest friend. I'll not. I'd not see friend slay friend, even other su even under such dark circumstances as these. Stay here. I'll deal with the Cold Hearth Lich. Besides which. Dealing with the undead is something Rel does. I, I, whatever it takes to see this false beard dead, here, take this. You'll need it if you're to battle a lich. We call it the secret revealed. Its light blinds all and burns all creatures on life. It may help you defeat the lich, but use it sparingly. It'll not last long. If it fails, ye bring it back. I may be able to make it work again once or twice before the secret's power is lost. Now, go find Coldhearth and lay the traitor low before he gets what he seeks. Okay, let's see what the secret revealed is. We're going to put that in there. Also, there's a chest up here. All that remains of the wax seal that once contained this ancient parchment secrets is a gray stain on its back. On the other side is a letter written centuries ago, in simple but effective penmanship making the message easy to read, despite its age. Dearest Corella, our journey to the Shadow King's outpost has been long and treacherous. Trolls, hobgoblins, gnolls, zwarts, and even a gargoyle stood twixt us and our goal. But we have finally made it across the coastway, crossing. If the map purloined from the Netherese vampire steers us true, Watch we cannot step. be far from our goal. Nothing good comes out of a place like this. Even if this venture proves as profitable as Walkins believes it'll be, I'll believe that when I see it, and perhaps not even then, there are many more dangers ahead. No property of the Shadow King will be left undefended. At a minimum, we are told to expect resistance from a small army of minor undead, which do not concern me overmuch, and a lich under the influence of the King's overmind, which concerns me greatly. Once these threats are dealt with, the going should become much easier. Along with the map, the vampire supplied us with a key it claimed opens the door to the Shadow King's inner sanctum. It spoke of a treasure room hidden within, loaded with items of great power and value. I send this letter to you in hopes that it finds you in good health and that we will be together again soon. But however soon that may be, it cannot be soon enough for my taste. Until then, I remain yours, Agda Coldhearth. The inscription on the inside cover of this small leather journal identifies its owner as one Gold Coldhearth. I keep wanting to call him Gold Guffer. The lettering beneath the name is only legible after several seconds of study. Written by the same hand as Coldhearth's name, it read, Devoted of Dumathoi, before it was violently crossed out, tearing the paper in several places. Gurn Coldhearth valued his secrets. The bulk of the journal's entries are written in a complex code beyond your ability to decipher. The latest entry, however, was scrawled quickly across the page in the common language of the realms. Must record this quickly before the memory fades. Last night as I slept, the mind of the Shadow King's lich touched mine. It confirmed that we will soon reach the outpost if we continue the dig. When we do, I will go to him and perform a ritual severing him from the Overmind. In return, in exchange, he will grant me what I seek. I no, no longer need I live in the fear of the sickness ravaging this body. I must push Deep Vein and the others all the harder to continue digging until at last what I so richly deserve is finally mine. So I'm guessing he's somehow sick? Okay. Give 
to me straight. So, back down we it. go. You must gather your party before venturing forth. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Okay. I've got this. And what I am going to do... Do you have I haste wish for up? Intelligent conversation? No. What do okay, you so what I need to do is before I go down into this room, I'm going to rest and do a little spell casting. Okay, good. They pester at me with more demands. I mean, do you want to die? Do it. Mm -hmm. I'm a ranger. I want to range. Really? I mean, fair. For me? For me! It is from Boo. He would like to say that you are a very pretty lady. Yes, and Boo has excellent taste. Like to see taste. a magic trick? So, this fair. is quite a compliment. I has thy nose. Uh, relish it. I mean, okay. We're gonna do that. Tell me. Don't worry about me. We're gonna pop open this door. Uh, who are you now? How did you come to this place? It's a long story. A story that ends in a pitched battle with a dwarven lich. You would see me destroyed. Try it then, please. I would know the extent of the power running through my veins. Okay. Give it to me straight. This isn't working. We have to try something else. This isn't working. We have to try something else. What do you need? This isn't working. We have to try something else. I'll recover. Come on. There we go. So now we need to find his phylactery. Do you think love can bloom even on a battlefield? Everything, and he must make room for Boo. I'm gonna take a super Whatever wild guess like. that it's probably back here. I'm also gonna take a super wild guess that there are probably traps in this hallway. Like, because we know... We know over in the laboratory there was a failed phylactery. And I can't walk in shadows because, um, that would turn off my trap sense, because apparently you can't sneak and, um, check for traps at the same time. Okay. 
Hey, that's a bunch of shapes on the ground. Oh, there's monsters about. Oh, hi, Corwin. Oh, crap. Hey um, there. Savannah. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Tell me. Um, First glance, this brass amulet appears to be wrapped in chains of the same material. Closer inspection reveals that the chains are molded along the surface of the charm. Well, go attack it. Then ask the um the what do you want? Uh, you're gonna do that. Trouble. Safana, you're gonna do that. Or McKean, you're gonna do that. Safana. Sweetheart? A medallion in the shape of an elven skull hangs from a golden chain. Small green gems glittering in its eye sockets. The skull is apparently hollow. Shaking it produces a barely audible rustling from within. Right. This modest, unadorned box is tied shut with a string of leather. A small fortune of precious stones is set in a large fortune of gold and silver formed into the shape of a box. Wrapped around the box is a long cord of supple material made of the hide of some exotic beast. An intricate carving of a rose with a long thorny stem wraps around the surface of this lacquered burgundy box. The carefully crafted piece seems heavier than it ought. Who has the key? Come down here. This isn't working. We have to try something else. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Um, Corwin, pass that key over to Safana. Your need. Yes, dear. This will not work. I must try a different tech. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Okay, we are making Another some headway. Okay, the lich is dead right now. Tell me. Don't Everyone is going to come up here. Yes. 
Yes, dear. With some effort, you dash the box, box to pieces. A small piece of parchment bearing the word soul is left in your hand. I'm a woman, not a pack mule. I dropped it. Okay, there's a Hurry. diamond there. Hey there. Right. Uh, you crush the golden elf skull. The gems in its eye sockets fall to the floor. The wooden box is easily smashed to splinters. A small piece of parchment concealed within drops to the floor and instantly crumbles to dust. I'm a woman, not a pack mule. I dropped it. Ah! I'm a woman, not a Sometimes pack I dream mule. I'm a chaotic good it. elf. So... Though seemingly composed of malleable precious metals, this phylactery resists all attempts to damage it. Destroying it may require power beyond the prime material plane. Yeah. Okay. Who has inventory space? You have inventory space. In a tick. You want me? Whatever you like. Hmm? In a tick. Oh wait, Safana, did you pick it up? Okay, yes, we did. Good. What? You hit the box, which collapses into splinters. A cloud of warm, moist air envelops you momentarily. With a sigh, it dissipates into the chamber's murk. Give it to me straight. Okay. We're probably gonna run into the lich again on our way out. I've got this. Not gonna lie, I actually kinda like- I actually like this. You do it. I and will. You move. What do you need? Don't worry about me. Okay, he is casting True Sight. But I think- oh no, I'm being followed. Tell me. You want it? You've got it. Okay, Safana. Yes. I'm going to assume I need to drop this on the ground. Uh, the discarded phylactery twists and warp seemingly collapses in on itself, vanishing from sight. The cold hearth lich's magic has likely drawn it back to where you first found it. Crap. This is bad. Hey there. Which means I'm gonna send Safana back to get it. 
while everyone else keeps the Lich busy. Rel, thanks. Safana. I don't even know what that does. Yes. Um, I'm gonna. Where's my last load? Yeah, I'm gonna reload because I think I see where I screwed up. What do you need? Yeah? All right. Wait, who has the phylactery? Safana does, I think. Yeah, we have the phylactery. Okay. Um, what I'm actually going to do to make this a little easier on me, I know for a fact I have a haste scroll. I actually have several of them. Good. They called. We're going to haste everyone up. Tell me. Don't and then me. we are going to book. And just take advantage of this haste spell to put some distance between us and the lich. You want me? The image of a fiery landscape appears, accompanied by a blast of unearthly heat. We realize that it was in such a place as this that, cold hearths, that the Cold Hearth Lich's phylactery was formed. Oh, ah! You cast the golden box down into the flames. As it falls, the metal turns molten. 
the surface bubbling and slowing off. The soul within screams. The soul within screams in rage and fear as the fire consumes it. No! I'll see you dead for this! I'll flay the soul from your body! Your miseries will be a legend across all the planes. Mm, no. Give it to me straight. You want it? Oh! This is bad. Uh, everyone's fatigued now. This is terrible. Um, we're gonna give you that one. You're going to dispel magic on that sucker. Resisting me. Ow! Please. Resisting me. Need to try something else. Um. You're gonna monster summoning that. Okay, let's think. How can I solve this? Sweetheart? This is bad. called that one happening. Okay. I think what I'm actually going to do... Oh. Great. What do you need? Hmm. Tell me. Don't worry about me. You want me? I'm a woman, not a pack mule. I dropped it. Alright, that should destroy the phylactery. Um, you need to... Yes? You need to drink a potion is what you need to do. You can pick that up. Thy card. Okay, we're gonna give ourselves a monster here. Give it to me straight. gonna get out of this fire room to a place that actually gives me some room to maneuver. Oh, that is not a good time for this to wear off. An army can't march forever. We've got to rest. Okay, I can quick save there. Yes. Um, I know I have another haste scroll. 
So what we're gonna do... Um, okay. We're gonna get as many castings of stuff off as I can. By demand. Yeah. We're gonna go with the protection from Your orders. evil. Dispel magic because that's an AoE. Uh, writhing fog. Tell me. Mm. I. What? You're going to try and get a bless off. Give it to me straight. You want it? See what I can do. Down here, back up, please. Also, mirror image yourself. Um, let's try this. Can't hurt us that way. Need to try. Oh. 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 Okay, you know what? We're gonna dispel magic, you. Oh. Oh. What? I understand. Oh. This is becoming a problem. What's this do? Um, Resisting me. Need to try something else. Resisting me. Need to try something else. And Rel stuck. Resisting me. No. Need to try something else. Okay. And the problem is, I can't get out of here. Okay. I might have to back up another save, honestly. Actually going to Okay. I'm going to actually grab this save here. What do you Rel, mean? you have the Tell rock. Me. 
Don't worry about me. I've got this. And basically what I have to do is um I have to be very careful how many times I use that gem. This group shows promise. Extraordinary. And basically what I need to do is... Uh, who are you now? Go in how here. How did you come to this place? Give it to me straight. Use that. Drink an oil of speed. Wow. Safana, how full is your inventory right now? Good. Yes, dear. Okay. What do you need? I? No Minsk is as brawny as the gum. Right. It cannot get everything. And he must make room for the Grab that. So what we're gonna have to do is there's I, I know there's no traps back here. Mule. I dropped it. What I drop? Look, I will come Tell back me. and get it. I've got this. Right now, I need to get everybody down to the fireplane place. Not happy about how far Safana's lagging behind, honestly. But what you gonna do? Because dude's gonna come down here. And then I'll be able to dispel his crap. And actually give him a permadeath. This isn't working. Oh. We have to try something else. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh. There we go. Okay. Give now we know the straight. lich is up here. What do you need? Rel, do that. Tell me. Give it to me straight. Get to stabbing. Yes. Get to stabbing. Okay. What do you need? You want it? You've got it. All right. We have taken care of that. And holy cow, that is a lot of experience.
Also, what is pinning her in place, actually? What status effect is on her? Stun! Fair enough. There we go. Tell me. And now we can go back to this room back here. And A, get Don't the cloak back, because I need to return that. And B, um... Um... Get the other treasures, that's what I was trying to say. Also, I will have to check out that statue. I see a question mark on it. Which tells me there might be lore inside of it. Okay. Also, who has the rock bag? Rel has it. Cool. We need to pass this around the party. Is as brawny as the gum. He cannot carry everything, and he must make room for Boo. There we go. I have a lot of stuff I actually do need to um, identify when I get out of here. But getting all these gems off my person will help. Okay. Give it to me straight. So step one, we're gonna Don't get out of here. Me. Cut from cut from solid stone, this statue depicts a sinister figure clad in a cloak of ancient netherese design. Huh. Alright, I think that's everything in here though. I think I can finally piece. Right, Rel is still hasted. Fair enough. So she's gonna get there like eight years before everyone else because I use an oil of speed on her. You must gather your party before venturing forth. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Okay. I quick save a lot. I'm glad I got into that habit though. You want it? You've got it. I've got I've had worse habits in this game. So, Rel has some space in her inventory. Good.
Your return? Is Coldheart dead? Tell me you ripped the Catchpenny bastard's head from his shoulders. Coldhearth is no more. He turned his back on me, on Great Dumathoin. There's a price to be paid for that. You've done me a good in turn and no mistake in it, Ralph. Here, take these, please. For myself, I'll stay here, cleanse this place of unholy elements within, and then... I can they say what happens then? We could use good men at our side when we face the crusade at Dragonspear. You make some sense. Alright then, when I'm done there, here, I'll make me way to da Dragonspear. Until then, keep your axe high, my friend. Hey, what do you need, you wee dauntless godfly yet? I was hoping you might help me with healing. Actually, I'm going to use the bed in the um, camp, thinking about it. Um, what do you need? How goes the sanctification? If you go in a good deal faster without the bothering of a answering pointless questions, I can tell you that much. Now, if you'll excuse me, there's much that needs doing yet. Axe is high. I know a dismissal. Gather your party before venturing forth. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Don't worry about me. I need a swig of some strong dwarven hail. Your cleric friends. Some are alive and they could probably use your help. Oh, I. Uh, yeah, alright, I'm good enough to go. Excuse me. I mean, I actually kind of just solved the entire problem, but, um... Let's get back to camp. Encumbered is she? Not over encumbered. I guess she's just kind of slow. So yeah, I think that wolf regretted it. Okay, now that I'm here, Belagarm. I have many fine wares. Uh, show me your scrolls and potions. Wand a magic missile. That's nice. Wand of sleep, potion of healing. Um, mirrored eyes, that's handy. Protection scrolls, greater restoration, I'm probably going to get some of them. Um, power word sleep, resist fear, clairvoyance, no... Fire shield, invulnerability, polymorphing. Ah, free action. Now, let's get some stuff I need. A glittering green helm adorns this 
A glittering green jewel adorns this battered metal helm infused with the power of the dwarven god Dumathoin. Okay, you. Decades ago, an adventuring priest of Gond discovered a cursed staff in a dungeon. Despite its curse, the staff was well-crafted and a fine-looking weapon, and the priest sought a way to lift the curse. Though he was never able to do so, he was able to add an enchantment to the staff, mostly negating its cursed properties and allowing him to carry it and put it away as desired. Though the staff was little better than a regular weapon, the priest carried it the rest of his days as it boosted his ability to carry treasure out of sub subsequent dungeons. That's actually pretty cool. That's just a plus one. Electrical resistance. Arrow of anti-magic. Arrow of ice. Protection from poison. Sword of Troll Decapitation. Scroll down, Mel. Runes along the length of this powerful blade spell death to trolls in multiple languages. A green gem set in the weapon's hilt glows with a pale green light. Legend tells that the famous dwarf Durlag troll killer used this sword in his adventuring days, but lost it during a particularly brutal fight in the troll hills. Durlag. That, that's the name of the guy whose tower we were in. Despite the item's name, it does not actually decapitate trolls. A rumor sprung up regarding its powers, and despite evidence to the contrary, the sword has never shaken the nickname. I mean, on a critical hit, again, that could actually still come in handy. This That's a wand of fear. Okay. I think what I'm gonna do. A pleasant enough walk, though I feel solitary so far from civilization's walls. I'd like to rest. Ah. <sighs> and on that note, I think that's where we're gonna. Holy cow! I was recording for an hour and a half. Yeah, that's where I'm going to lead them off. Uh, next time, I think we're going to go try and find the third of the halflings thingies, because there was the cloak, the mirror, and I think it was a shield. But that's for next time. Thanks a lot for watching, and take care of yourselves, alright?